All right, Shalom. I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakak, Wadash. I want to seek double honor to the apostles and the elders, a great millstone for teaching his word and truth and sincerity, and for ruling well. And salutations to my fellow Akim across the four corners of the globe, preaching in the name of Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. And this is the brother Gabar Yahweh, from GMS Hawaii, coming to you with another quick lesson. And then it's on inflation here in Hawaii. All right. Um, as you brothers know, we, we the brothers, we live here in Hawaii, um, preaching this truth. We starting to see a lot of higher prices here in the state. And, uh, you know, I know across the country, prices are rising. And Apostle Tahar did a video in, um, in where he's at about uh, gas and inflation. And, um, you know, this thing is changing. I think they said uh, yesterday I heard. By the end of the week, gas prices here are going to be $5. Now, that might not seem like a lot to some people, but when inflation is rising, housing housing prices are, in rise, are rising, and, you know, basically, uh, job money ain't rising. You know, employment pay is not rising. So, you start to see this debt be transferred to the people, all right? So, it says right here, Hawaii, triple A Hawaii cited inflation and higher price, higher oil prices as the major reason for the rise in gas costs across the country. So now most people will try to blame it on this whole thing in Ukraine, but it's not. It's inflation and, and, and higher oil prices as a major reason for the rise in gas across the country. Oil prices are close to $100 a barrel. Reported Triple A Hawaii on Thursday, February tenth, the average price for a gallon for a gallon of gas statewide is four dollars and forty four cent, about a dollar more than the national average. So out here, we we also have to pay for the fact that they got to ship the oil here, and they got to refine the oil, or whatever, for us to get fuel here. So we're not just paying whatever. So whatever. The prices on the mainland, you could add a dollar on to what you're paying here. And that's all due to debt. You know, America is in like 30 plus trillion dollars in debt, you know, and they're in debt to the bankers. And the people that got to pay for that debt are the average citizens, man. All right. So, but this is what the scriptures say. Habakkuk 2 and um, 6. Shall not all these take up a parable against him? And ta in a taunting proverb against him, and say, Woe to him that increase of that which is not his, how long, and to him that laden himself with thick clay. And that word for thick clay, that word for thick clay is I bought ya, I bought ya. And it says, Weight pledges heavy debts, you know, and that's what. America is in right now, heavy debts, you know, and again, the people that got to pay for that are the average everyday citizens, man, you know, and, and we're the most affected, especially those that just, you know, barely making it through the month, barely making it through the week. And you see why inflation and it's going to get it's going to get higher than that. I went to the gas pump yesterday. And it was almost five dollars. I think it was like four forty three or something like that. Four forty? No, no. Let me take that back. I think it was like four fifty, fifty three, four fifty three. I believe because um, as soon as I put it, put the thing in, shit shot the five dollars. I was like, God damn, you know what I mean? So stuff is really expensive right now because this this article was February tenth, you know, and we're in March, so. And you see right here, um, gas prices in many U.S. cities will hit five dollars in weeks. Some already higher, and you know you can you see what's going on that inflation, man. And so with that, when you say uh, uh, slack, yeah. Uh, so with that, I want to say shalom on to the next.